Finally this evening, when Paddy Hemingway's plane was shot down over Essex during World War II, he miraculously lived to tell the tale. Now, all these years later, that very plane is being dug up by archaeologists to mark the 75th anniversary of the D-Day landings. Sally Williams joined them for the historic dig. To many, it's just a pile of mud. But buried somewhere in here is the wreckage of a Second World War hurricane like this. Just some of the few to whom all of us owe so much. Given the tranquility, it's hard to imagine the scene here on the 26th of August 1940, when the pilot Paddy Hemingway was shot out of the sky in the Battle of Britain. Somehow he managed to bail out of his aircraft and parachute down to the ground. The first thing to be found today was an old machine gun. Yeah, so they'd have had four in each wing. Then nothing for the next two hours. We're getting deeper and deeper now, and what's really strange is that you can actually smell aviation fuel. Finally, after several hours digging, bingo. Right on the wreck now. Yes. Rolls Royce. Yes. Amazing. It's found a controlling arm, so what the, the, the uh, pilot held the joystick. joystick. Wow. Yeah. What you got there, Gareth? This is the tail wheel off the back of the hurricane. When the pilot realised he'd, he'd had to, got to get out, he'd have slid the canopy, the hood back, along this rail and parachuted out. But that was one of his last contacts, he slid the, slid the hood back down that. So that's a that's amazing. Quite a bit of history there. Behind the dig and filming it for a documentary is Jeff Clark. It's just nice to be able to be here and uh, be proud to be British again and have something that's, you know, say something that's of heritage and uh, stands for everything that Britain's supposed to be. The day was marked with a fly past. The team can't wait to share their find with the pilot Paddy, who's now 99 and a hero of the hurricane. Sally Williams, ITV News, Thurrock. Amazing findings.